I've always been an advocate for um, the legalization of cannabis. The emphasis is on quality, and we are all about growing the best cannabis possible. We were lucky to get our marketing firm from Seattle, and it was back and forth and back and forth to get our concept just right. I know that our dispensaries appreciate that marketing because they need brands that are willing to tell the story behind it. We are currently in about 140 dispensaries. You can find us in Eugene, the coast, in Bend. You can find us in Portland. Our customers, they ask for our product. And one reason that we've tripled our production this year is because we've been unable to keep product on the shelves. Everybody knows that we're organic and they appreciate it. Currently, right now, Rebel Spirit uh, is stepping into more of a role of taking on its own wholesale distribution of its own product. We are open to sell as a producer. We also have our wholesale distribution license. So we have the ability to offer our product to any OLCC approved dispensary as recreational. We're really working to stay ahead of the curve. So that's why we were one of the first ones in Oregon to get our license. We knew we wanted to be first to the punch on everything. We at Rebel Spirit are really dedicated to following all the guidelines and we work really hard to do that. The industry is growing so fast. We are thinking about moving into other markets, uh, say California, Washington, or any market actually in the United States, and make edibles, salves, and tinctures, and whatnot that people in the U.S. now really want for health reasons. A lot of what we're having to do is figure out, well, what is the newest thing, and how do we get there first? Rebel Spirit has really had the chance to get in on that ground level, and fast growth it is.